I'm Troy Beverly, and this is Pan-African News. Tanzania. Tanzania to build $1.3 billion fertilizer plant to become net exporter. The Tanzanian government and Indonesia's largest liquefied petroleum gas refiner and ammonia producer have agreed to build a $1.3 billion urea fertilizer plant to allow Tanzania to become fertilizer self-sufficient by 2029 while creating 400,000 jobs. The administration of Tanzanian President Samia Suluhu Hassan through the Tanzania Petroleum Development Corporation, the Tanzania Fertilizer Regulatory Authority, and the Tanzania Investment Center signed a Memorandum of Understanding with PTSA Industries Indonesia to construct a urea fertilizer plant that will use Tanzania's abundant supply of natural gas to produce urea fertilizer to end the nation's dependence on fertilizer imports. Construction on the plant is to begin this year and it should be operational in five years. As stated by the Daily News, the executive director of the Tanzania Fertilizer Regulatory Authority Joel Laurent mentioned that Tanzania imports 87% of the fertilizer used by the nation's agricultural industry. The commissioner and board member of ESSA Industries, Rahul Puri, recommends that Tanzania consume 60% of the fertilizer it produces and export the remaining 40% to neighboring countries, including Zambia, Congo, Uganda, Kenya, Rwanda, Burundi, and Malawi. The acting director general of the Tanzania Petroleum Development Corporation, Francis Wakapalila, explained that the initial requirement of natural gas for the urea fertilizer plant will be 70 million standard cubic feet, which will be easy for Tanzania to supply given its natural gas reserves of 55 trillion cubic standard feet. As observed by the STAR, the urea fertilizer plant will be a boom for Tanzania's agricultural industry, whose fertilizer demand increases by 30% each year.